was a great learning experience because I learned so much more than I did sitting in a classroom at my school. It was a once in a lifetime opportunity and it was awesome. The Washington DC National Rural Electric Youth Tour, sponsored by Scambia River Electric Cooperative, the Florida Electric Cooperatives Association, and the National Rural Electric Cooperative Association, is part of a grassroots program to educate high school juniors and seniors on the electric cooperative program and the cooperative ideas for which it stands. Around 30 students from Florida travel to Washington, D.C. for the week-long tour, joining about 1,600 students from 43 states across the nation. The tour is jam-packed with fun-filled activities and visits to America's most popular and historic places. Stops along the way include the U.S. Capitol, the Korean and Vietnam Memorials, Arlington Cemetery, the Lincoln Memorial, and the Smithsonian, among countless other museums and areas of interest. Whenever I first saw the schedule for the Washington trip, it was really overwhelming because everything was really specific and there was so much to do in one day. Oh yeah, the schedule was very packed and we walked like nine and a half miles in one day. But once you actually get there, you kind of realize that it all just kind of flows together and it's not stressful. We went to the Marine Corps Sunset Parade, which I really enjoyed because I'm in band and I love watching their military band and listening to their music. I also like watching the Marines do their drills with their rifles. Definitely if you're interested in any, pretty much anything, Washington DC has a museum for it. So you never get bored. Overall, through the sleep deprivation, it was a good trip. And it was worth losing the sleepover. A special event during the tour is the Rural Electric Youth Day, where students hear from prominent speakers and take part in a town hall meeting. The Youth Day program was fun because we had a really good speaker and they gave us time to meet new people and to, we had these lanyards that we could collect pins from different states and so they gave us time to go exchange pins and then different people came and told you about different ways you can get involved in your community and volunteering and different opportunities for college and just some tips for your future. Perhaps the most significant part of the tour is the students' opportunity to meet with their U.S. Senators and Representatives. The future leaders of tomorrow had the chance to chat with our leaders of today. Although the youth tour experience is filled with fun activities, the overall purpose of the program is to increase students' understanding of the value of rural electrification, become more familiar with the historical and political environment of the nation's capital through visits to monuments, government buildings, and cooperative organizations, and visit elected officials in order to increase students' knowledge of how the federal government works. When I got to Washington, there were so many places to see that had such historical significance. I learned a lot more about like the American government system because I never really thought about it before. And then going to DC and being there at like the heart of it, you know, you got to learn what specific people do and different chambers and how laws are made. The Washington Youth Tour is a terrific experience. Only a lucky few take the trip each year, and those that do said they wouldn't miss it for the world. I think the Washington DC trip is a great opportunity for students, especially in rural areas where it might not be as easy to go to big cities like Washington DC and then it's just a great opportunity for kids to get out of their small town and go see things and learn about the country. If a junior asked me whether or not they should participate, I would tell them to do it and don't think about it. Just go for it because it's going to be a lot of fun. The Washington DC Youth Tour, a memory that lasts a lifetime. Looks like fun, doesn't it? All of the students who participate in the local competitions are invited to travel to Tallahassee, where they join more than 100 other high school juniors representing electric cooperatives all over the state of Florida. There, these students have the opportunity to take part in several different activities, such as participating in a mock legislative session, visiting the Challenger Learning Center, witnessing Supreme Court cases, or participating in a mock trial, and a trip to the Fun Station. We went to the House of Representatives and we got to go see this IMAX movie at the Space Museum. And then at the very end of the night we went to this ginormous arcade and got to play laser tag. We went to the state capitol and we went to all the capitol buildings. We got to sit in on a mock session. We got to give our opinions about certain issues and we played laser tag and arcade games. As you can see, this is a great opportunity and a great experience. The purpose of the Florida Youth Tour and the National Rural Electric Youth Tour is simple. Students develop a greater understanding about their electric cooperative and its leadership role in their community. 
honestly, before the trip, I didn't really know what an electric cooperative was. I didn't realize that it was such this milestone when they were formed that before we didn't have electricity in rural areas and that it makes this huge difference and it's kind of something that nobody really thinks about but it really is a phenomenal thing that we have. The event also allows delegates to make new friends from across the state, friends that share their pride in their local communities. This is a unique opportunity to educate you, the leaders of tomorrow, about electric cooperative ideas and the workings of state government. I met a gazillion of people. I made a lot of friends from all around Florida and we still stay in contact so it was fun making friends that I would have for a really long time. Become a part of the experience. Participate in the Florida Youth Tour program. I made a lot of good memories. This trip was a week-long trip by myself so I've never really gone anywhere without my family so it was kind of like this step of independence. I thought you know why not write one essay and I'll probably get to go and I got to go to Tallahassee and then I won a trip to Washington. It's worth all the extra work and it's worth the being nervous about the interview and it's just the Tallahassee trip is fun and then DC is just totally worth everything. It is definitely great.